Moving your arms and legs requires planning by your nervous system and action by your muscles. The part of the brain that does the planning is called the posterior parietal cortex. In here, different groups of neurons fire when you imagine different movements. Now, researchers have been able to figure out how to move a robotic arm just by thinking about it. The researchers started by identifying which neurons fire when a person imagines a movement. For example, this neuron fires when a man imagines rotating his right shoulder, but it turns off when he imagines touching his nose. Then the researchers connected specific neurons in a person to the robotic arm. Here, a man who has lost the use of his arms and legs moves a robotic arm for the first time. Just by thinking about it, he can shake hands, pick things up and let them go. This same technique can be used to control a cursor on a computer screen. Tapping into the brain like this is the first step in connecting complicated thoughts from our brain to robotic limbs.